I think that Paul is rightly considered to be one of the great contemporary scholars of the transformation of Latin America. His work on socialism and populism and labor movements in Latin America and their intersection with both democracy and dictatorships really helped set a generation of scholarship on a track to being able to integrate nuanced history with broader social science theorizing. I moved from history to political science. And one reason I did that is I think the two can learn from each other. And I think history provides a great laboratory for testing political science theories. Because all of a sudden you have many more cases. If somebody wants to study how is the best way to manage elections, well, instead of just looking at a few cases nowadays, I can go back 100 years and show you how they managed elections and which worked and which didn't. I shared the UCSD belief uh, that there is not necessarily a conflict between re research and teaching. And in fact, they're mutually enriching. And so I enjoyed teaching the students because I could try out my theories and discoveries and ideas with some of the smartest kids on the planet. And they would enjoy learning about it. And I enjoyed learning from them whether or not I was on the right tracks. He is a collaborator. He co-authored with many different people in the field besides his solo authored books. And more importantly, had a generosity of spirit that really carried over to his service as senior vice chancellor at a time when the university was in crisis due to the financial crisis of 2008. When I became vice chancellor, first I thought uh, that my background in Latin American politics would help. I thought that I probably already knew how to deal with financial crises and student uprisings and attempted coups and all of that, but it turned out that wasn't really so important. What was important was the steadfast support of faculty and staff across the campus for the changes we were trying to make. To our community, he helped create uh, the Preuss School, for example, which serves the San Diego community and really represents a living legacy from UCSD to educational innovation to help people from lower income groups achieve the dream of college. The medal is very important to me because it, it also recognizes a lot of other people. It recognizes legions of people who helped me conduct the research, teach the classes, and manage the programs. And so I owe a huge debt of gratitude to all sorts of folks here and abroad and I think the medal partly belongs to them, uh, in particular to uh, family, friends, colleagues, faculty, staff, and students at UCSD.